going to do Glute Max now. So it's the most superficial of all the glutes. Um, glute Min was out through here, which is covered by Glute Me. And then Glute Max comes over and covers the posterior portion of Glute Me. So um, hip extension will bring it up. Um, you can see the border of it there coming up through here. So it comes off the posterior aspect of the ilium and then the SI, oh sorry, the sacrum and then um, down onto that coccyx and that sacrotuberous ligament and then cutting across into the ITB in the um, gluteal tuberosity. So I tend to find with this, flat palpation, just cross fibre, the easiest to, to feel the trigger points. Um, and I, there's obviously the trigger point up higher and then there's the lower ones down through here as well so you can palpate through that region. But as we said again, you need all where you feel the trigger points, yeah? Band up in here. And the needle straight into that. Normally you can get this with sort of more, um, or less deep, or long needles. Um, still using a 75 though, just because I don't know whether we'll quite hit it with the, the 40 that I had out. So, so we're there, and we're needling just straight. So unlike glute min where there was a lot of sort of fascial tension, it was a bit hard to get that needle in, this one shouldn't be as, shouldn't be as bad. So you just put the pressure on, feel the resistance to the needle and then just sit it there, a little bit of a twist back and forth. So just leaving that for a sec there, the, the muscle relaxed a bit and then I'm able to pass it through into it now. 